Yeah, we've got behind me a uh, 2010 Lincoln MKS. And uh, on all cars, there's basically three uh, computer modules. There's an ECM, a PCM, a BCM. So engine control module, powertrain control module, body control module. They might call it instead of ECM, engine control unit, ECU, same thing. Anyways, uh, on this particular car, I'm going to change the ECM or engine control module and the eternal question is uh, where is it how do I take it off so on this car again 2010 Lincoln MKS uh, MKS isn't Sam this is the ECM or engine control module that's what it looks like okay so the EC ECM on this car is underneath this cowling right about here so take this this guy off. You have to take these windshield wipers off. You notice that the uh, w each windshield wiper is held on by a little bolt here, and the other one is right here. Those are 15 millimeters. Take them off, and then I've actually already loosened mine up. <sighs> and then the key thing to know about these windshield wipers is if. It should be able to pull it off, but a lot of times they're stuck because it's a spline. This bolt is like a spline, and it, these kind of get rusted on there. So PV blaster, uh, and then I use the little battery terminal puller to get underneath to pull it. So if you've got a battery terminal puller, a gear puller, a tie rod puller, you may have to use that to get these to pop because a lot of times, like I said, they, uh, they get stuck on there type of thing. So after... You uh, take these off. Oh, yeah. Take these off, get these out of the way. So uh, this cowling is held on by little push pins. So there's one here, one here. I've kind of taken this apart a bit, so I'm ahead of the game here. There's one here, one here. Well, it looks like there's one here too. So uh, yeah, there's probably what? One, two, three, four, five. Actually, there's one here. So there's six of these push pins you have to get off. And uh, they're easy to get off. Just get a pry tool and pry them up, pop them off. So once you get the uh, windshield wipers off uh, and then you pry out these plastic push pins, this comes off. So once you get this guy up and off, you're gonna see that this rubber hose is connected to your windshield wiper fluid hose. So it'll connect here, it will connect to the sprayers on this guy underneath. So you just gotta pull them off. Just pull them off. Just pull them off. And then this guy should come out. Get him. Out of the way. Actually, it's it's kind of a two part. If you look at this, it's really two parts. Got this on top and this underneath. But yeah, just kind of grab this and get her out of the way. And then, voila. There is. There it is. ECM engine control module. So there's a little bolt right here. And a little bolt right here, probably, I'm guessing these are probably 10 millimeters. And then it should, then you got to take these off. So these just pull, 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 and these come out, take the bolts off. It should slide out. So, all right. All right. These are... Uh, 10 millimeters. Yeah, so just undo them both. Oh yeah, there it comes out. There it goes, there it is. There's my old one. Bada boom, bada boom. So I got the old one out. Came out pretty straightforward, which as you know on cars, uh, nothing is easy, but this was Pretty straightforward, thank God. Very simple, straightforward. The hardest part is probably, in all honesty, 
getting the uh, windshield wipers off, those little spline bolts, because they rust on there. So PB blaster, uh, a gear puller, tie rod puller. So as you can see, here's the old, here's the new. So now I just got to put that one in. And there we go, that bad boy, that uh, new ECM or engine control module, I've got it in, easy peasy.